Hello everybody. In this meeting, we will talk about linguistic theories and it will cover basic theories and the figure Ferdinand de Saussure and Noam Chomsky and next is their contribution to linguistic. So, here linguists and linguistics. Linguistics is a branch of knowledge who study language and linguist is the person who study linguistics. So, Linguist is the person, and linguistic is the knowledge. A person who studies linguistic is usually referred to as linguist. However, a linguist is only analyzed the, lang the language, but it is not merely that the linguist talk the language. Okay. For example, I'm here speak English, and I study Spanish, so it doesn't mean that I'm a Spanish speaker. They only describing and explaining language, not concerned with the prescriptive rules of the language they study. It is not interpreter or linguist is also not required to know many languages. So they only study the language and analyze it, get the research in it. Okay. Their goal is to discover universals concerning language. Okay, we know that we have a father of linguistic, Ferdinand de Saussure and Noam Chomsky. Here is it. Ferdinand de Saussure, 1857 until 1913, and Noam Chomsky, 1928 until unknown years. However, we can see that the year of Ferdinand de Saussure's existence is earlier than Noam Chomsky. So it is very possible for Noam Chomsky to study what Ferdinand de Saussure, uh, what Ferdinand de Saussure found, or Ferdinand de Saussure's books is also very very possible read by Noam Chomsky. But it is impossible for Ferdinand de Saussure to study. Noam Chomsky findings. Here, Ferdinand de Saussure, language and speech composed of a system of signs. It is his uh, opinion or his findings. Put precipitated from the social environment, and then language was not an innate act, so it is studying people study language and they able to speak the language in it it is not in it it is not the same with the their, their parents and the person language and speech are learned while the person is interacting with the other person and influences so when we get influences to another we get uh, what is it influence each other to get the language and this theory has been read by Noam Chomsky, of course, and Noam Chomsky has his own idea that language is an innate example, baby will cry, it is the, and the facial expression, it is called by uh, language is an innate. So when a baby born or when a person born, they has specific language human language for example baby cry when the baby hungry or thirsty or feel uncomfortable and then the facial expression when the person angry will be understood by others that others can understand that the person is angry and then all the children use universal grammar it is called by universal grammar how we communicate with others region of country which do not know our language and we also do not know their language we can communicate with them uh, we communicate by universal grammar for example by our eyes or for example by saying a voice like hey okay would say hey we know that they call us then 
focus on a child having in it universal language using syntax grammar so syntax is a structure of language so uh, in it language also have their own structure it is Noam Chomsky idea guys and however my conclusion is that Ferdinand de Saussure and Noam Chomsky complement each other Ferdinand de Saussure has an opinion that language is studying and Noam Chomsky has a opinion that language is innate but my conclusion here I have a conclusion that both person study language by innate and study so uh, we can we can uh, we can speak the language or we can use the language to communication uh, belonging from our parents uh, on the heritage of ours and uh, also we study from the environment uh, the result is that we can speak with our parents language or we can speak with society language which are our parents do not know the language for example for example an Indonesian person speak Indonesian a Japanese person speak Japanese and they go to uh, America and the person able to speak English of course and then the person's parent cannot speak English because they only speak language but the person able to speak English speak Japanese and speak Bahasa Indonesia uh, it is about Noam Chomsky contribution so Noam Chomsky term contribution is transformational grammar transformational grammar uh, rules a sentence with a given grammatical structure but the same essential meanings for example Tony makes the robot and the robot is made by Tony and generative grammar generative grammar considers grammar as a system of rules that generates exactly those combination of words that form grammatical sentence in a given language Noam Chomsky also contributes naturalistic approach this naturalistic approach to the study of language has also affected to the philosophy of language and mind and Chomsky hierarchy this is the important point guys it is about the classification of formal language in terms of their generative power classes of formal grammar it means that uh, every society class has their own grammar yeah Noam Chomsky found that and Ferdinand de Saussure contribution Ferdinand de Saussure contribute course in general linguistic it is a book regarded as the starting point of structural linguistic Saussure distinguishes between language language and speech language and pararul language lang langu and speech is language and also Ferdinand Saussure found the sign, the symbol, symbol of language, sign of sound that convey a meaning. Ferdinand Saussure also contributed an arbitrary, relational, and confessional language. The language is arbitrary. It means uh, why the letters called A, why the letters called B why we have the things called computer why do not call computer as table it is arbitrary so the name of a thing is agreed by all the people in the world <clears throat> and there is no reason about that synchronic spoken by community and diachronic linguistic is historical development of language and then the next Hauser contribution is structural linguistic it is classify all elements of corpus at their different linguistic level okay guys I think this is all our that I can explain to you only a little 
a little description about linguistic and however we can study further by studying uh, the Saussure books or Chomsky's book and we can study here and found in some journals usually in uh, usually in linguistics research yeah okay I think this is all for me good day. Yeah.